What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading. Have suicide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with you. Free general collective reading. It's very important to only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Um, thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. We're, um, it's 11,395 subscribers right now. So thanks everybody for all the love and support to the channel. You guys are just the bomb freaking diggity.com. I love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, I do, I do, I do who just saying. Okay. So when I was meditating on your energy this morning, um, I or this afternoon, rather it's two or 3 PM central standard time. Um, I received a couple of downloads, so I'm going to share them. Um, I hope everybody is doing well today. But the channel message I received was, um, uh, an Aries masculine is about to start getting very, very, very heavy negative karma. Um, and an Aries feminine neighbor, um, both of them are hiding huge secrets from a fire sign feminine. It's for some and for some a water sign femme. Um, they're about to be exposed and exposed extremely quickly. At least one of these people will end up in jail soon. So you plug it in how it resonates. Aries, Aries energy strong, Aries masculine energy, and Aries femme neighbor energy. And I was pulling Aries femme neighbor energy the other day for anybody that doesn't know or you didn't watch that reading. Um, but it's Aries masculine and an Aries fem neighbor. Um, I heard they're holding huge, uh, huge secrets from a fire sign for some of them and for some a water sign uh, fem. So fire signs are Aries Leo Sag, water signs are Cancer Pisces Scorpio, um, the, and they're feminine energies. So these fem energies is Aries masculine or the Aries fem neighbor that's holding back from the... Um, fire sign femme or the water sign femme, um, the, they, the femmes could have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Aries, Leo, Sage, and their sun, moon, rising, Venus, North, them in here, Jupiter charts. You plug it in how it resonates. Heard at least one of these people end up going to jail soon, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. One of these feminine energies is about to get surprise communication soon from someone they never would have never thought is going to lead to series of chain events for them to get a protection order against one of these Aries or some two plus Aries. Spirit messages you have collected. Wow, that's strong. So one of these fem energies, either the water sign fem or the um, way too many four. Um, either the water sign femme or the fire sign femme, Aries Leo Sag or Cancer Pisces Scorpio feminine energy. Um, I heard someone, they're about to get unexpected communication from some they, someone they would have never expected. So it's from someone they would have never expected and it's about to be unexpected communication from this person they would have never expected to receive communication from. And I heard this communication from the person this, this femme energy or energies would have never expected to get communication from. It's going to lead to them getting a protection order, I heard, against one of these Aries. So you plug it in how it resonates. It's either the Aries femme neighbor or an Aries masculine. So you plug it in how it resonates. And one of these Aries masculines is very, very, very high in their community. Severe abuse of power. And one of these Aries masculines is very, very high in their community, uh, severe abuse of power. So they have abused their power against this person, um, one of these femme energies, or maybe both of them, or somebody else. But I think the person that's about to, you could be the person that's about to reach out to these femme energies, or you could be the femme energies. Um, or you could be the Aries masculine or the Aries femme neighbor. You have to plug yourself in wherever you resonate if you do. Everybody's on a different time in life paths. If this is not your story, it's not your story. It could be somebody you're connected to. But however this story plugs into your life, if it does or it doesn't. But um, so however it resonates, um, 
there's an Aries, one of these Aries masculine. So it sounds like it's two plus in the universe. They, um, I heard they're, they're high in their community, but they have used their power. So I think they've used their power against these fem energies. It could be an abusive husband, an abusive boyfriend, an abusive boss, an abusive, um, coach or leader in some shape, form or fashion. They can have Aries in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Moon, Hammer, Jupiter charts. It is a um, Aries masculine energy. However, that resonates in one's life. But somebody they would have these fem energies would have never expected is about to deliver the information to these fem energies to cause them to get the protection order against this Aries masculine position. And one of them is well, one is not all of them, but one of them is the position of authority in the community in some shape, form, or fashion. So I'm thinking uh, uh, maybe they're on a board, they're a high leader, influential leader, um, maybe they're a coach of a ball team, manager, boss, CEO, supervisor. Um, and one of these Aries is a feminine that carries very heavy masculine energy. And one of these Aries is a femme that takes on very heavy masculine energy. So one's a masculine energy and one's a femme that takes on very heavy masculine energy. So a lot of Aries energy in here. And then we have the Aries Fem neighbor. So you have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, wow. Holy crap, crap, crap. A Capricorn is going to start getting gang stalked soon. It is about to piss them off in a huge way. And a Gemini about to start getting gang stalked soon. Oh my God, a lot of gang stalking. So a Gemini and a Capricorn is about to start getting gang stalked soon. Um, this, the, good God, this is some heavy energy. So you plug it in how it resonates. So Capricorn and Gemini energy about to start getting gang stalked soon. I didn't hear if they were masculine or feminine. Hopefully it's not you and might be somebody you're connected to in some shape, form, or fashion. Gang stalking is not fun, you guys. I have been gang stalked. Me and my kids, we have been gang stalked. For years we were gang stalked. It's not fun. It's really, really not. Now, I just laugh at the situation. And if I can start getting gang stalked, I'll have a damn conversation with them. Throw them off kilter. I mean, because, hell, I've been through it. I know how to handle it now. I didn't know how to handle gang stalking a couple years ago when it one, I've never been a gang stalker. And two, I would never want to put that kind of negative or harm out into the universe. So I really didn't know what the hell was going on. But then I figured it out. But how that resonates, I heard a Capricorn and a Gemini. It could be masculine or femme, Caps, masculine or femme, Gemini. They could have Caps or Gemini in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Midham, or Jupiter charts. But I heard they're about to start getting gang stalked soon. We have vulnerability on the bottom of the deck. I think this is the gang stalking energy and the energy of the person. One of these fem energies would have never expected to communicate with them about this information on this Aries masculine energy or Aries fem that takes on heavy masculine. This information to cause them to put a protection order against these person, uh, person or people. Um, vulnerability. They feel vulnerable in the situation. They want to protect themselves. Um, and one of them, they're about to protect themselves with the protection order. Um, and I don't blame them. I don't blame them. Uh, you plug it in how it resonates. This is really sad. This is really freaking sad, man. But, um, un I feel this is unsafe energy in here. Unsafe energy, feeling unsafe because of the gang stalking energy for the Gemini and the Capricorn. Um, and unsafe energy, so much so fem these fem energies are about to start uh, putting protection orders against either an Aries masculine or a femme um, that takes on heavy masculine energy, Aries. You plug it in how it resonates. I didn't hear if the Aries femme neighbor was going to get a protection order against her. I mean, hell, I guess it really all depends on the choices she makes. You plug it in how it resonates.
And a particular Pisces feminine is about to turn on a Cancer Femme in a huge way. They know the real, real, real truth now. They're about to really expose it very publicly. One of these people is a reader. One is a nurse. One works in the office sector. Oh, my Lord. So you plug it in how it resonates. Wow, there's a lot going on in here. A lot of messages. So you just have to plug whatever messages in that resonate with you. If they resonate, don't force anything if it doesn't fit, okay? If it's not for you, it could be somebody you're connected to or not. But don't force the messages if they don't fit, okay? But um, Pisces Femme energy strong. Um, I heard a Pisces Femme is about to seriously betray a Cancer Femme because they know the real, real, real truth. So, obviously, okay, so the Cancer Femme lied to the Pan Pisces, basically. The Cancer Femme lied to the Pisces, and I heard the Pisces is about to expose it very publicly and very soon and very quickly. So, if I was lied to, I'd expose it too. I mean, I don't blame this Pisces fem, whoever they are in the universe. I don't blame them. I mean, if you're lied to, you're lied to. Um, and you should have that right to speak the truth. Speak your truth. Speak the truth. Speak truth. Um, and it sounds like what this Pisces fem is about to do. Um, it's about to create many negative series of chain events for this Cancer Feminine. Many. And other people. And a Scorpio Masculine. And a Libra Feminine. Okay, I heard it's about to create many negative series of time events. This Pisces Femme speaking her truth, or the truth, or some kind of truth, um, is about to create many negative series of time events. I heard for it, this Cancer Femme, this, uh, a Scorpio Masculine, and a Libra Femme. So, um, you Pisces Femme, if you are the Pisces Femme, and this resonates for you, you only, you know your story, not anybody else. Don't force it if it don't fit, but if it is your worst, you, you, of course, you take it, but you plug it in how it resonates. But this Pisces fam is about to expose the real truth. They know the real truth. They're about to expose it very publicly and very quickly. Um, whoever they're about to expose it to, now, it, that could resonate differently for different people. Only you know your story, not anybody else. But whoever this Pisces fam is about to expose it to very publicly and to a lot of people, it sounds like two plus people, it's about to be effective. Very, very, very effective. Very very, very, very effective, I heard. Very. So, very, very, very effective. There, So, it's going to be very effective, whoever they're about to expose it to. But I heard it's about to go, it's about to go positively. It sounds like for her and whoever was lied on or situation was lied on or what have you. But it's going to go negatively, I guess, for the liars, the ones that lied to her. I heard Libra Femme, Cancer Femme, and Scorpio Masculine. So, you plug it in, how it resonates. That sounds like a good toast goes to talk. I can't speak. Good dose of karma, if you ask me. Um, but you plug it in, how it resonates. And that could be the vulnerability energy as well. Um, these three are going to feel vulnerable when the truth is exposed. But in all fairness, they shouldn't lie. Um, that's what I'm feeling here. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. And then we have stillness. A Cancer Feminine is going to start getting gang stalked very heavily, too. Oh, my God. There's a lot of gang stalking in here. We have Capricorn energy, Gemini energy, and Cancer Fem energy coming up. It sounds like upcoming in the universe about to get gang stalked. You guys, I have been gang stalked. It's not fun. Every freaking where I went, everywhere I went, in my community. Now, if I traveled outside my community, I was not. But inside my city and my community, I would get gang stalked. And I'm serious about that. It went on for years. And it's the truth. So I know how gang stalking feels. And it doesn't feel good. And that's just the truth. But at least three energies in the universe upcoming sounds like they're about to start getting gang stalked. So I don't know who the hell is, thinks gang stalking is effective. Um, it's not. That's mental manipulation and mental mindfuckery at its worst. I mean, it all depends on how strong mentally strong these people are to handle gang stalking and if y'all remember about a month ago i was pulling into aries about to start getting gang stalked and they were full on blown getting gang stalked so i mean this is crazy gemini capricorn and cancer fem all upcoming getting gang stalked now that could be in an hour it could be in 10 days it could be in a month 
I'm not sure, but upcoming, whoever these people are, it could be masculine or feminine Capricorn, masculine or feminine Gemini, feminine Cancer. I'm feeling, you know, the JJ energy with the Cancer fam. So you plug it in how it resonates, and that could be the stillness too, slowing down, um, slowing these people down. Because the whole purpose and premise of gang stalking, for anybody who doesn't know, is to slow people's growth down, to slow their growth down, to slow them down, to make uh, to make them go, try to make them go crazy, basically, thinking it's their fault when it's really not their fault. It's other people doing it to them. But it's a whole form of mental mindfuckery, basically. But the stillness energy I'm feeling with the gang stalking is to slow them down. They don't want the truth coming out. They don't want the truth coming out. They don't, it's like, it's kind of like, it reminds me of like a um, doll, but an evil doll. Where they want to stitch up their lips. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm feeling. I'm serious. That's really fucking sick. Nay, 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 nay. And I'm serious about that. You shouldn't have never done what you did to these people anyways. To cause, to make you feel so threatened to, to, to gang salt their ass. And that's just the truth. You should let people live free and happy as long as they're not harming themselves or anybody else, period. And that's the truth. So I feel this is um, slowing down energy, a temple attempt of slowing down energy for the stillness energy for some. It could be trying to ruin their careers. I didn't hear any of that. But I feel like slowing down, trying to slow them down with the gang stalking. And um, the stillness energy for the femme energy is to get their protection orders against the Aries, masculine or Aries femme with heavy masculine. Um, and then maybe the stillness energy for the Aries femme neighbor because she's done something super, super damn shysty, man. I'll just tell you that. Super freaking shysty. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Someone is about to enter into this Aries feminine home very soon. They're about to realize huge, huge changes and they know it was done from stolen money. Someone is about to implant a hidden camera in their home very soon and make money off them. Whoa, you plug it in, how it resonates. Oh my God. Okay, so Aries feminine neighbor energy coming in. Okay, so, wow. So our someone soon is about to enter into her home. So she's about to free willingly allow somebody in her home. Um, and I heard when they enter into her home, I heard they're gonna see a lot of changes. So financial changes, I think probably home improvements, Nice, fancy furniture, possibly. Nice things in her home when they were not there at one time, is what I'm presuming. Um, and I heard when they enter in her home, they're going to notice all these changes. Nice, fancy things, nice changes. But I heard they know it's it's on stolen money. So it's on stolen money. So this Aries fan neighbor, if she's your neighbor, and you know this resonates with you, obviously she's um, keeping to herself and she's not letting anybody know that obviously she sold this money for maybe you or somebody you're connected to, but she did. And now she's over there buying all these things or doing nice home improvements and yazzy, yazzy, yazzy on your stolen money or somebody else's stolen money. But somebody about to enter her home is about to realize it was on stolen money. And one of these people is about to call the police. When it is a, per uh, when it is a maintenance person, not the person about to implant the camera. Oh my God. I heard one is a maintenance person. So she's about to have two plus people in her home. In her, her home. One is a maintenance person. One it is. It sounds like personal. It sounds like the one that's going to enter in personal is going to implant the hidden camera. And I heard they're going to make a lot of money off her. So, um, you know, secret voyeur, hidden camera, secret sevenness type energy. Um in her home soon upcoming sounds like it hasn't happened yet it's about to for the aries femme neighbor maybe your neighbor or somebody you're connected to's neighbor and then i heard a maintenance person so you know there's a million different maintenance people it could be a contractor it could be if they own the home if they rent it could be somebody coming in through the landlord or the company the uh, the apartment complexes um people what have you but they're about to enter in the home. 
by the owner of the home. Two different people. One on the personal side, one on professional side. I, the one on the personal side, I heard, is going to enter the hidden camera in her home, and they're going to make a ton of money off her. So some kind of voyeur camera energy. And that's upcoming. And then the maintenance person, I heard, is about to get a huge wake-up call, and I heard they're going to call the police. So um, something's going to alert this maintenance person. Now, if the maintenance person knows, sees all these huge changes, financial changes, and obviously realizes that they have stolen money either from you or somebody, somebody you're connected to, that could be the call to the police or it could be some other kind of call to the police. Maybe they have dead, um, you know, decapitated heads in a damn jar and they don't cover them up before um, the maintenance person walks in. Or maybe the maintenance person hears screams of, um, children in the backyard or some crazy shit and p um, children are locked up like cage animals in their backyard i mean we've had you know there's been that's been true story um i've seen that on the news before um so i don't know is what i'm trying to say um but something is going to alert this maintenance person to call the police um and it's going to be very effective very effective it's going to piss off this aries feminine neighbor Okay, I heard it's going to be very effective. It's going to piss off this Aries spin neighbor. So, yeah, this is sad. So, stillness. Um, they're about to get stopped, basically. The maintenance person is about to be very, very significant in this. The per person on the personal level is just wants to steal from them. They just want to steal from them. But, in all fairness, this Aries spin stole from somebody in the past. And now, they're about to get their negative karma with this, the theft. And I don't wish negative on anybody or theft on anybody, but it sounds like it's karma cycle, so karma cycling around the universe uh, for her for on the personal side. But the maintenance person is about to, something is about to alert the hell out of them in this home. They're about to make a phone call. It's about to be very effective. The stillness energy here, I feel, is the slowing down of this Aries femme thief, criminal. They're a freaking criminal. I don't know how to explain it. They really, they're just a criminal. Um, I'm serious. Okay, I didn't. All right. Well, I love you guys so much. I hope this helped and namaste.